Hey everybody, welcome back to the Wolf Pit with another episode of What Are We Eating? Cream Chip Beef Gravy, also known as SOS or Shit on a Shingle, is a very simple to make, delicious, and stick to your ribs meal. It's typically served over toast or sometimes simply white bread or biscuits. I've even seen people eat it over mashed potatoes. SOS has filled the bellies of our soldiers through world wars and is popular and most of all, a delicious meal in diners and in your home. Even though cream chip beef is really simple to make, some people don't have the time, desire, or wherewithal to make it themselves. And they want something fast and convenient that they can heat and eat. Like Stouffer's frozen cream chip beef gravy, and SK's off the shelf unfrozen cream chip beef gravy. Neither of these are new products. I remember eating the Stouffer's as a kid and I loved it. And I'm sure at some point in my life, with me living in the Maryland area and SK's being a Baltimore product, I've had it too. So I'm gonna start off with the SK's cream chip beef gravy first. This 11 ounce unfrozen or refrigerated pouch of SK cream chip beef gravy costs $3.98, which is a bit pricey if you ask me. There's definitely a lot more ingredients in here than there is in my homemade cream chip beef gravy. Mine consists of butter, flour, chip beef, and milk, along with lots of pepper. There's no need for salt when you're making cream chip beef gravy. There's plenty of salt in the chip beef. Now this is a little laughable to me. Two and a half, half cup servings. That definitely wouldn't cut it in my house. As a matter of fact, I made some the other night, and there was definitely more than a cup and a half on my plate, which is equivalent to this whole bag. Per half cup serving, there's 160 calories, 11 grams of total fat, 4.5 grams of saturated fat, no trans fat, 40 milligrams of cholesterol, 580 milligrams of sodium, nine carbohydrates, no fiber, two grams of sugars, and six grams of protein. SK suggests serving it over mashed potatoes or noodles. There's no mention of toast, bread, or biscuits. What's up with that? You can either heat it up in boiling water or nuke it. And y'all know me, I'm taking the easy route and nuking it. It says to cut along the dotted line, then place the pouch upright in the microwave for two minutes. It doesn't get any easier or convenient than that, does it? After heating on high for two minutes, our cream chip beef gravy is ready. I like to eat it over toast sometimes or bread sometimes. Today, bread was the choice. Why? Because I was lazy. I didn't feel like toasting the bread. But you can eat it over whatever you like. Probably wouldn't be that bad on a flip-flop. But if you do try it over a flip-flop, let me know how it turned out. It certainly looked good and like the real deal. And I'm really glad you guys couldn't see the long rope of drool hanging from my mouth. It really did have my mouth watering. And I know it looks like a lot of chip beef gravy, but it's only about an eight inch plate. And it definitely has a good amount of chip beef in it too, which is a nice surprise. So I dug in and gave it a try. I was a little disappointed with the initial bite. As I expected, it definitely needed pepper, but that's an easy fix. But it also had a pasty mouthfeel and it was a little on the sweet side which the sweetness I found a bit strange. So I added some black pepper to see if it would somewhat tone down the sweetness. The pepper addition obviously helped, but it still had a pasty texture and flavor, like there was a little bit too much flour. Even though I'm a little bit disappointed with this being a Baltimore product and it not being that great, it was still pretty good. So now let's try the Stouffer's Cream Chip Beef Gravy. This 11 ounce frozen package of Stouffer's Cream Chip Beef Gravy, the same size as the SK, costs $2.08. So for the same amount, it's half the price. Winner winner cheap cream chip beef gravy dinner. If you noticed on the SK Cream Chip Beef Gravy, the first ingredient was water. But in the Stouffer's, it's skim milk, which milk drinkers still probably consider water. SK also had skim milk, but it was further down the ingredient list. There's also two and a half half cup servings in the Stouffer's as well. Per serving, there's 130 calories, seven grams of total fat, two grams of saturated fat, no trans fat, 30 milligrams of cholesterol, 550 milligrams of sodium, eight carbohydrates, no fiber, three grams of sugars, and eight grams of protein. And just like the SKs, you can boil or nuke the Stouffer's because I'm lazy and that's what lazy people do. They take the easy way out. It says to poke holes in the pouch, then microwave for seven minutes, and then let it rest for one minute to complete cooking. After microwaving on high for seven minutes and resting for another minute, it was ready, and it was still like lava. 
Again, I'm serving it over white bread, but this isn't your ordinary white bread. It's Wonder Bread. Nothing but the best for cream chip beef gravy. I don't know if you can notice it or not, but I can. The texture in the Stouffer's is a little bit shinier and not as pasty looking as the SK. But again, there's a good amount of chipped beef. So I dug in and gave it a try. The Stouffer's cream chip beef gravy is definitely creamier and more like the way I make it at home. But they both have one thing in common. They need more pepper. With the addition of pepper, the chip beef gravy was pretty much spot on. And it almost tastes just like the way I make it. Both brands had a good amount of chip beef in them. Which believe it or not, good chip beef is pretty pricey depending on the brand you buy. I like the Armour brand and a 4.5 ounce jar is almost five bucks. Both the SK and the Stouffer's were very edible. I didn't like the SK's pastiness, which also caused it to have a slight doughy flavor. But one thing I did love about the SK was the sturdy packaging. It made it a whole lot easier to handle with the hot lava inside. But the Stouffer's is probably gonna be the best prepared heat and eat cream chip beef gravy you're gonna find. And it's half the price of the SK for the exact same amount. So with all things considered, Price, value, and taste, I'm giving Stouffer's Cream Chip Beef Gravy a 9 out of 10. In my opinion, Stouffer's continues to make superior quality and delicious frozen foods compared to other competitors. And their prices are the same or lower in some cases. The SK Cream Chip Beef Gravy gets a strong 7 out of 10. I think if it was loosened up with a little bit of whole milk, it would fix the pastiness I personally didn't like that much. If you'd like to help support the Wolf Pit, consider being a patron. You can pledge as little as a dollar a month, that's only $12 for the whole year. Or, you can pledge more. That's up to you. Either way, every little bit's appreciated and helps me produce more high quality videos more often for you, the people. Thank you all very much for watching. Please don't forget to like this video and subscribe, and I'll see you soon.